What's up, Panda? It's Peter Von Panda here. Hey, you may like going out and exploring the wilderness, uh, and you may have thought about putting together a little EDC pouch for yourself. This is a great one, brand new, and uh, it's pretty cool. And I want to not only kind of quick show you this, I already did a full review on it, but I wanted to uh, give away kind of a homemade EDC kit, you know, kind of put the things in it that I would want to have with me you know something small just like this you know no bigger than uh you know a, a wallet so that it'd be easy to grab and have supplies with you um so stay tuned i'll tell you how to win this one in the giveaway we'll give it away via facebook um so ultimately when the video is over just follow the uh instructions that i give you and and enter and we'll hopefully uh, one of you will be out there with it uh super heavy duty you know 600 nylon i think a clip here to uh, hold in something in this expandable pouch, maybe your cell phone, what have you, pen slot here, two big zippered pockets with uh, a subdivided pocket inside, and then molly straps on the, the back here so you could attach it to your belt, attach it to a pack, whatever. Um, this one's in black, obviously, and pretty nice. So you're gonna get this, but that's not all. What is uh, a survival pouch without some sort of cordage? So you're going to get this. It's a brand new uh, bracelet with paracord. So you're going to have plenty of cordage here. Uh, 550 cord, you can cut it open and use the individual strands for tying things up. But this by itself will give you a lot of cordage. Then the other thing that's on here is you get a whistle right here. It might be a little hard to see. Woo! Little whistle. You'll have a compass built into it. And then you also have, what you'll see here is a kind of a plastic buckle. But on this end, you also have a little scraper. These two together uh, will create a spark because this is a little ferro rod right there. So you can kind of scrape it to create a spark if you need to. So there's a lot of stuff just in this paracord bracelet, but you're going to get this. Now I'm going to duplicate some of the, the features on there too because uh, you are going to get, you know, in wet weather conditions, uh, one of these little ferro rods too. A little steel scraper. Uh, ferro rod there all tethered together with a paracord lanyard so you're going to get that be able to create spark out in the wilderness now maybe you don't need to go through that effort because you have this edc gear this is a uh, aluminum tube anodized in green here waterproof crush proof certainly high um you know high quality construction you have a striking surface there and it comes packaged from the company with a bunch of stuff here so you get some really big outdoor matches that are all sealed up. You have some Q-tips and an emery board and some cotton. So you have kind of tinder there to, to light something up and you don't have to worry about it getting wet or crushed. Even the striker is inside of this. This thing alone is pretty cool. I really like this because, you know, if you don't need the matches and stuff in there, you can also put other things, so your pills or whatever you might need. So that's pretty cool. You're going to get that. Then you're also going to get one Mylar space blanket. You know, this is going to be good for wrapping yourself up, creating a little shelter, um, protecting yourself from rain, whatever. You're going to get this little bad boy. Boom. All right. You are going to get this. Uh, I did a review on these. It's a 480 milliliter, you know, portable, collapsible, rollable, foldable, plastic water pouch bottle. It does have a little carabiner on here, so it should clip to things. But you could roll this little bad boy up and put it in that EDC pouch too. So you're going to get that. So you're going to have a little water carrying container. No point in having water carrying around, especially in a survival situation, if you can't process it. So you're going to get a strip of five aqua tabs with a little card here on how to you know, use it to disinfect water. So if you get stuck out there, you can collect water, you can sanitize it and drink it up. And then you are also gonna get a little first aid kit here. Uh, I'm just gonna pop this one open. I did a full review on these types of first aid kits before, but as you can see, it's not just a pouch. It absolutely has, you know, it's small and, and, and squishy. You can obviously pack it into a lot of things, but it's kind of nice because you do get a little assortment of things here. Iodine in Q-tips. Um, a bandage, some tweezers, you know, some tape, uh, scissors, and then just kind of regular um, band-aids and things like that. So you do get a little first aid kit uh, in case, you know, something happens. You need to treat a small injury. 
Hopefully not, but you're gonna get that too, right? Then the last thing you're gonna get is this multi-tool. Did a review on this. This is the Black Grand Harvest Stainless Steel Multi-Tool. I was actually pretty impressed with this little bad boy. It has a uh, clip here to clip it on. It's kind of like, to me, what Swiss Army knives should be. You have, you know, your standard kind of Swiss Army-like blade. You have a lot of other tools on here, including corkscrew for opening your wine bottles, uh, screwdrivers, etc., etc., And, you know, even the thing that I always thought was the sexiest thing when I was a Boy Scout says, scissors, you have scissors. And these were actually really nice um, for cutting little things and even a saw. So you get a lot of tools just in this little multi-tool and it's not that small. I mean, it fits in the palm of my hand, but very uh, good construction, solid and, and a little bit weighty, maybe even weightier than what you'd want to take on a backpacking trip. But you get all of this. So what I'm gonna do is hook someone up. All you have to do is uh, go ahead and go to the description in this YouTube video and follow the link to the Facebook post. I'm gonna create a Facebook post about this and then uh, like that Facebook post. That's it, that's all. Uh, if you live in the Canada or the United States, you're gonna be eligible for it. I will ship it to those two locales uh, on my dime. If you live somewhere else that I'm not including and you are the random uh, liker of the Facebook posts that I pick, uh, and you're willing to cover the shipping costs to you, I will do that just as long as you're of age to be able to receive these things and it's not illegal to ship it where I'm shipping it. Uh, but if you're willing to cover the cost and, and, and end up being selected as a winner, I will uh, hook you up with it. So now, uh, get entered quickly here. We're going to give this little bad boy away on August 12th, 2017. So go ahead and follow the link to the Facebook post, like it now. Um, and uh, hopefully one of you will have your little EDC pouch ready to be assembled at your house. Peter Von Banda, out!